G'day and welcome to this impromptu episode actually. While I was editing my next video and putting kind of still putting the script the script together, I got a special delivery from a friend. I am one lucky Victorian because I've scored a six pack of the Cascade Export Stout Old Gold Limited Edition. So I thought, why not just put together a quick little video of me cracking open a can and doing a taste test. That's what else are we gonna do videos on? So let's pull out a can. All right, so we'll give you a closer look at the can. Uh, Cascade Export Stout Old Gold limited edition and as I say five five 5.9 5.8% alcohol by volume so what it says here it says we're a limited release we bring you an exciting twist on a traditional stout crafted at Australia's oldest brewery this collaboration between two famous icons is inspired by Cadbury old gold chocolate with a roasted malt and dark chocolate flavor dense creamy foam and a balanced bitterness this will keep you coming back for more. I've actually heard it said coming back for more when it's a limited release of uh, 5,000 cases. So there's not many out there. Um, beer made in Australia. That's always good to see that on there. There's some other bits there. Yep, sorry, get that back in the middle. There we go. Alrighty. So I've got my trusty beer glass. We'll tap this open. And I'll give it a sniff out of the can. Ooh. The initial sniff was just a strong beer smell. But then it has got a bit of a chocolatey after smell as well. Let's see how good I pour this. All right, so pours real dark, like a stout should be. And it's got a nice dark head there as well. All right, let's see. Yep, you can definitely smell a chocolatey smell. Maybe a bit of a, yes, what else is there? A bit of a, I'm trying to think of what it is. It's like a burnt coffee, a bit of a burnt coffee smell maybe as well. All right, let's give it a taste. Oh, the foam's good. Yeah, definitely a nice, nice and there is a bit of the chocolatey taste there as well i don't drink stouts that much there's a bit of a, a coffee flavor there is a bit of a coffee flavor in there and i don't drink coffee that much i actually probably don't drink coffee at all um that's probably the taste that's coming through the most is like a a coffee bitterness Yeah, that's a good, it's a good taste. I don't think that's gonna be something, I don't think that's something, that's gonna be something that you wanna drink all the time. Like it's not like a session beer. Um, this is just like a, a taste beer. Like the, for the uniqueness of the mix. You know, creating something unique between two iconic Aussie brands. Um, yeah. I don't know what else to really say about it, really. Um, like I said in my last video, I don't really drink beer that much or alcohol at all anymore. And I've cut right back on the sugary, sugary drinks. Um, trying to think of what else, what else can you say about the beer? If you're lucky enough to try some, try some. I've got the couple of cans here, so yeah, uh, good so far. Mm, yeah, 
you're definitely tasting more of the chocolatey flavor now. Old Gold is one of my favorite chocolates. Mm, yeah. So if you're lucky enough to give it a try, definitely give it a try. Um, I'm sure there's heaps of Tasmanians that have all given it a try so far, over, Chris, uh, over Easter, I should say. Um, if you're lucky enough in Victoria to get some, get some. If you're lucky enough anywhere else in Australia to get some, try and try and give it a taste. You know, unique beers are kind of hard to get a hold of sometimes, especially when they limit it to one, you know, part of the country. Um, but other than that, that's going to be the end of this short little video. Cheers. That's definitely good. That's definitely good. Yep. No, oh, what's that? Alrighty. Oh, cheers. See you in the next video.